Hello DCS World, this is Brian from Pilot Shop Simulations with another Gazelle video for you. Uh, today we are going to be covering the weapon system of the Gazelle. Um, as you may know, the Gazelle carries the HOT-3 missile system and we'll go through and uh, show you guys how to do that today. So first thing we want to do is go down here and turn your master arm on. Okay, so the Gazelle has the optical system on the roof. Um, go to that view right quick to show you. Alright, so we need to get it started. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch over to the commander's position here. And we have three rotaries. We have one here, here, and here. We want all of these into the full clockwise position. And you may be able to hear the camera starting. Um, you have a key safety here. You want to turn that to the jour position. Go ahead and turn your TV camera on and at this point we have to wait three minutes for the camera to cool down uh, due to the wonders of video editing I'll go ahead and skip forward to that okay so the three minutes has gone by and um, we got a little closer here because we were a little out of range but um, anyway let's continue so we have this rotary here at the bottom uh, we want to turn that one position counterclockwise looks like to the P position here. Okay, and the camera has several functions here. We have the zoom function, which is self-explanatory, and we also have a night vision IR function. Um, it's really easy to spot targets with this. Um, as you can see, it's uh, pretty well functional. So we go ahead and line up on one of our tanks here, and we uh, I already taken them off, but there's safety levers here for the uh, laser and fire buttons. So it's here, here. We want to have those up. Uh, next thing we want to do, we have our target sighted here, is we want to hit the E key to slave our helicopter to the target. That pretty much gets it in line uh, for a shot. Okay, so and as you can see here in the controls indicator, we are slave to the target. Uh, next thing you want to do down here is there's a rotary for missile selector, uh, pylons one through four with a safety in between each uh, labeled zero. Uh, easiest thing to do is hit the D key to change which pylon you're using. Okay, so we have our target and we have a pylon selected. You get this little rectangle here. Uh, as you can see from the range, we are 3,750 meters away. Um, we have the rectangle. That means that's pretty much launch, au launch authorized. Uh, so at this point, we're ready to shoot. So just go ahead and hit your fire button and guide your missile in with the crosshairs. Uh, it follows exactly where the crosshairs are, so keep it dead center of your target. and we have a good hit. Okay, that tank's smoking. Let's on to the next one. Again, new target, lays it, get the range, D key for a new pylon, and shoot.
And there you have it. That's how to operate the weapon system in the Gazelle. So I'll go ahead and shut everything down here. Switch back to the pilot's position and we'll go for a short flight back to Groom.